Hello everyone and welcome back to another Fortnite video. So in this video we are going to cover all the changes that are coming with the 15.21 update. Uh, we are going to get through the video because the update has already started but before that please make sure to drop a like on this video and also subscribe to the channel. We started the road to 2700 subscribers so if you haven't yet please subscribe. Now let's get to the video directly on uh, with all the changes that has happened with this update. This is how the Predator skin is going to look in game Most likely we are going to have some gameplay as well later in the video And here we can see the new mythic item which is going to come in game with the Predator as well A uh, new mythic item makes you go invisible Okay and pre it is called Predator's Cloaking Device. Become nearly invisible for a short time. Effect is removed by swapping weapons or when swimming. Let's see, we're going to see how this works in game, but this is the Predator NPC, so Predator is going to be an NPC on the map, same as it is the Mandalorian skin. And here is the new mythic. Uh, these are the 15.21 new cosmetics not pictured in Predator Pickaxe, so only the Predator Pickaxe is missing here. But yes, we can see the Hunter's Trophy. Uh, Grim Keepscape from a far off world, we can see the Predator, the Bio Helmet online uh, dance, uh, something that we don't know, Yao Tiao wrist plates. oh yes, so these are the swords, uh, which we cannot see now, uh, we have the Hunter Arsenal, we have uh, all these emotes uh, and the loading screens as well, these are the Predator items, So this is how the minimap is going to look in the 15.20 update, uh, basically not any visible changes but we'll see in game uh, if there are any changes. Uh, Predator is going to be at, at the stealthy stronghold, uh, there is going to be his NPC and we can find his mythic uh, weapon as well. Uh, these are all the Predator images in the files which are encrypted so we should expect some gameplay soon. Uh, here are his uh, pickaxes So these are all the things that Predator set will uh, include It is the Predator skin, the Hunter's Trophy bag link, the Bio Helmet online built-in emote and the Hunter's Arsenal As we saw in other pictures as well So there might be a helicopter spawn at Stealthy Stronghold uh, But nothing is confirmed yet but seeing from the files uh, we can see that uh, there might be a new helicopter spawn or maybe the only helico helicopter spawn that we are going to have on the map but nothing is confirmed yet so far here's a look at the jungle hunter quest that you are going to need to complete in order to obtain the predator skin set so remember the predator skin is basically the secret skin for the season 5 of fortnite so you have to complete some challenges in order to get the predator set and here we can see all challenges, you can pause the video and read them one by one if you want to. Uh, here is the Predator set, we saw that already but let's see the blades because that's the only thing that we haven't seen yet so far. So these are going to be the pickaxes of the Predator, I believe this will be uh, equipable only with the Predator skin and won't work with other skins. We have a new battle pass icon now, uh, we can see the predator is included in the battle pass as well. And the member only emotes also got updated, this is the free emote that are, is going to be given to all the people which are subscribed to the uh, Fortnite crew pack. And here we have the look at the predator bio helmet online built in emote. And here we have the full Predator set in game.
So the map was slightly updated to this update, the Stealthy Strongholds the, is the only place uh, that there are some changes. As we can see in the images, in the pictures, they are not very clear, but... So here we have some new props that will appear at the Stealthy Stronghold, stronghold or the Predator POI. So props, basically, uh, they are some new objects. So the new crew pack was added to the files in the update and is currently encrypted so soon we should expect the new skin uh, of the new crew pack for the February. So these are some patch notes, uh, this might be wrong but these are the values that Epic changed in this uh, in the today's update. So the white chest type might return in the map or especially in the stealthy stronghold. The teleport buffs are back and some henchmen might be back as well. We should also see in this update this sun tunneling uh, getting fixed and being in the game activated after being uh, disabled for so long now. These are the Predator's mythic sounds. So the Predator Rub is going to be reactive to your weapon firing, uh, so this is a pretty cool rub actually if and if uh, it's going to be reactive it makes that even cooler. So we have some update about the Flopper Thermal and Medkit. Uh, this is what the Battle Pass menu is going to look now with the Predator set all showing. And we can see all the rewards that we uh, are going to get uh, with the Predator. Here we have the Predator furniture in game. So basically, these are the new uh, objects that we saw earlier that are going to appear. So as we said, uh, the you can't use the Predator pickaxe with other outfits as usual. The pickaxe is going to uh, appear as. Uh, as the default pickaxe, here we have the predator cloak information, the, this uh, predator uh, new mythic weapon lasts for 30 seconds, the cooldown is 30 seconds, movement and water reveal your lo location, a warning will be issued 5 seconds before you decloak. Here we have an event file which was updated, we can see it on the image here, we can't tell anything. Uh, we can't say much about this but there is going to be an event about for this season or maybe at the beginning of the uh, very next season but i believe it is going to be uh, for this season so we are going to see in the later weeks about some leaks or some new information that we might be getting for the events so these are the events that have been re-added in the 15.21 cube might return so we have the crack lighting, the cube spawn sounds, the cube island, the Galileo or the Star Wars. The predator mail, um, mail information, we have three types of attacks dealing 20 to 30 damage, environmental damage 100 to 200 and knockback opponents. So basically this is going to be used from the predator and I don't really know uh, if players will be able to uh, if players will be able to equip this after they eliminate the Predator. Here we have the cube spawn sound which are being re-added into the game. So basically the Predator uses his pickaxe as a weapon in game and here are the stats. Damage per hit with a knockback is hit, uh, hit 1 20, hit 2 20, hit 3 30. Environment damage is hit 1 100, hit 2 100 and hit 3 200. And also some updates from the leakers about for uh, according to the event files. If you are seeing leaks about old events being re-added to the files, it is simply nothing. Fortnite adds those materials again to use. Uh, on other things in the game, this does not mean that 
this does doesn't mean nothing so we should not get hyped so we uh, about the event files that we saw being re-added to the game uh, this might be fr from epic side just uh, re-adding them so they can use them for other things and here we have the uh, predator objects that appeared at the hunter's heaven So this is all the information that we have for this update today. Thank you guys for watching and staying here with me. Please make sure to drop a like uh, on this video and also subscribe to the channel if you are uh, if you haven't subscribed yet so we can reach 2700 uh, subscribers as soon as possible. I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, bye.